I'm, I'm just asking everyone tonight, sort of, if you were stuck on an arc, what would you do to entertain yourself while you were there? Oh, that's a great question. I would read. I'd have a library. I'd have a huge library. That's the end of everything. The beginning. I was lucky because Dan's script was really detailed and he had a very strong vision of who Ela was. And I think, you know, having rehearsal time with him, having long conversations with him and Russell, and also, I don't know, I just instantly got this gut feeling. I had this very strong intuition about who Ela was, and I think that helped too. She's beautifully innocent and kind of very raw and vulnerable. Mm. But on the other hand, she's also incredibly strong and very wise. And I love that kind of contrast within her. She's She was a really interesting character to play and, and a really beautiful one. Obviously, I try and relate things that have happened in my own life to things that she might be going through in order to try and bring some realness to, to the part and to my performance. Um, I can't say I have first hand. I'm so glad that it worked out, I guess. <laughs> They've been jet-setting around the world promoting their latest film, Noah, and now they've touched down in the Big Apple. Yeah, Emma wants... Emma was looking gorgeous as ever and revealed she actually fought quite hard for the role. Uh, I mean, Darren did put me through my paces. He gave me some scenes that I hadn't ever seen before and gave me five minutes to look at them and I had to... Uh, go through the scene. I actually had to cry in my audition as well, which is which is reasonably hard. But um, yeah, I just I really wanted the role. I loved the project so much right from the beginning, and um, I'm just so glad that it worked out. I guess. <laughs> I mean, I expected a lot of it, honestly. I think all adaptions, biblical adaptions, kind of receive that kind of attention. Um, but I I don't know. I just felt confident that what's pe once people saw the film for themselves that they would feel that the film was actually sensitive and inclusive and, and exciting and, and that it should be on the screen. We also couldn't take our eyes off heartthrob. To be honest, I expected there to be controversy. I think all biblical adaptions carry the weight of response has been really positive. And I think the film, when people see it, will realize that it is very sensitive. Um, and inclusive.